Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, What the Beck. If you've seen this before, that's because I've already done a flip through of it, but today I'm going to be flipping through the second half of my modified planner. Like this was the original planner I used and I modified this part. And if you want to see what's inside this book, and the first half of this one then you can click on this card up here and that will show you my beginner planner flip throughs i actually started planning in august before i went to college or like right before i went to college and this is just my first full year of planning and i'm going to show you the second half of this book so as you can see i have a custom cover in here since this is clear I can just cut anything I want and hole punch it. So I have an illustration by Cindy, um, some s'mores scrapbook paper, and then Halloween scrapbook paper, and my sticky notes. But if you've seen the other video, you already have seen all of this. So I'll just skip right past it and go to this page, which is the week after the last week that I showed in the other video. And this one was my first playing with me video. And I did like gold and black and my setup was a mess and I had so many, like I had to learn how to edit and upload the video and do formatting and all that. But this is really good memory for me because it's like, I kind of like got myself together and started actually making videos. And yeah, I'm just really proud of this one. And we were doing running training and all this and last day of school and things like that. So this is in June, by the way. Um, and then the next one is just cute kawaii theme with a little weenie dog. I love weenie dogs and you can probably tell that by looking at this. But it's kind of like just kawaii. I think there's also a plan with me for this one. And then in the next month we tried to make our own stickers and we had little hamsters. And then this week there's also a plan with me of this. And I'll link the Plan With Me playlist up above if you want to see any of these. But some people were like, why do you do so much? Like, why do you fill the space so much? And it's literally because I was on vacation and I didn't need a ton of space. So I just use it in a creative way, making it look like the ocean. And then the next week I was going to Interactive Introverts. So I put these, um, like just printed out from the like, show like there were pictures of them and the logo and just the t-shirt design and I did the whole thing based off of that and I actually like the washi on the side I don't know how many times I did that since then but I like it but I can't do it anymore because I'm an Erin Condren now which will have a review video in a couple weeks but yeah then we have Rick and Morty that was also a plan with me monkeying around and this has some play with me as well. It looks like I didn't even use that checklist. In August, when I went to this giant convention with my friend, and then I had to go back to school. So this was a week when we were at the convention and we were super excited. And I also just got paid, so I had extra money from dog sitting and this time I didn't really fill it up, so I went back and I wrote in like to practice lettering. I wrote Clark is a good boy because that was the dog I was dog sitting. And then is it time for the convention yet? And finally made it to Florida. And then this was kind of just like making it cute because I didn't have a lot to do. So I just made it pretty. And then this week, I don't know what happened. It's hard to turn the pages because it's so stuffed since I put both halves of the planner back in. Um, looks like I didn't use it the next week of August. And then August at the 20th. So this, I recycled a like Discover credit card advertisement that came in an envelope like that. And this was probably my last week before school. Um, and there's a plan with me of this one as well. Um, switch out planner pages. So yeah, this is probably right at the end of the other um, half where I had to remind myself to do that. And we were in the move-in team at school. So we got free dinner and we got some t-shirts for free for helping them. 
move in all the freshmen. And then this one's pretty cute. I think this one has a plan with me as well. Short term goal is get home alive. That's <laughs> that's pretty much where my priorities are. I like that I put the planning, the planner sticker over here. Um, I usually put it on Sunday, but I don't know. I'm thinking of changing up when I do my planning, but I'm not sure yet. So then I put my, all my classes on here since I was just got back to school and yeah, I had new classes, so I had to write them down. This is just some like doodles. And then I started my rainbow week so when I was at school and I did the red week. Um, which I didn't have a red one for Habit Tracker, but I had pink, I guess. And this actually turned out pretty cute. I like the little stars. Orange, which my boyfriend was making fun of me because I used pumpkin stickers in September, but I said they're orange and I'm gonna use them wherever I want to. And yeah, just using some, some of these cute stickers that I got from a giveaway. And this is when I had my own giveaway, so I had to mail a bunch of stickers off to some people. The yellow week. And this kind of reminds me of my B week that I did in the other video that I showed in the other video. Um, but I like all the like lines everywhere. See that? And I think I did actually cut this washi into a flag. So I might have to try that again later on. Dumb test 6 a.m. I am not sure what that means. Maybe our fire alarm went off or something, but <laughs> I'm generally confused by that. Um, then we saw a movie. I practiced some more lettering. Didn't use the checklist again. This is kind of where I realized I don't want to use checklists in my planner. I want to use checklists in my bullet journal. Um, but there are videos on that if you want to see it. The green week and I started doing journaling. And the reason I wanted to start doing journaling in the planner was because I had all of these stickers that were like reaction stickers, but I don't really want to put like a, an upset face on something that says like homework for example because then I feel like it'll make me feel negatively about doing the homework even if I otherwise wouldn't so I'm using them more as like responding to what happened in the day and I think this worked out really well and it was really cute that I had the color coordinated part and yeah so before we get back to the rainbow we have the doodle challenge that I did this is the inktober challenges and for October, the, then we have the blue week, or it's kind of tealish, I guess. Um, and then this is where um, the stickers came in handy because I had a really bad day and I have self-care stickers that I use um, for that. And so I had a place to put it down to say that I had a bad day and remember that. And then my purple spread at the end of the rainbow. Continuing with the journaling, I drew the little guinea pigs down here, using up some things I had, like this was a card stock, just like, um, like a card, and some stickers and things like that. And then I tried to track my steps, but on Tuesday I goofed and I didn't put it. Okay, <laughs> that's actually pretty funny. And then this spread was actually, like I, had a lot going on, like I had some meetings and there were midterms and things going on. So I was opening this up in a lot of my classes and people kept asking me about this particular one. And they're like, oh, I like the purple. And I'm like, well, thanks. <laughs> but yeah. And then this one has a plan with me. Um, I think a couple of the rainbow ones did, but not all of them because I was busy with school. So for this one, I used all of my mom's supplies, except for this reaction sticker, which is my own. But I used my mom's supplies, which she got from pen paling. Um, and we put lace on the top, all of her, I used only her planner stickers and other stickers. This is actually a cupcake liner and a piece of cardstock here, just to make it interesting. And then another, kind of like spooky week. 
Um, I made my pumpkin and I drew it so that I would remember which one I made, which is actually really nice. Um, I used Spider-Man because I was going to be Spider-Man for ha Halloween. Um, and then I voted. People were like, why are you driving an hour to go vote? And I'm like, because I have to. It's, m it's my job, <laughs> you know? But yeah, so... This is the first interview that I had with people at the school to get my cat approved to stay there. And that was before I even knew if I was allowed to get one. So that was well, pretty long ago, actually, like a month and a half, two months like that. Not sure. I tried to use my um, monthly spread more because I don't usually use it. And I'm planning to change that in the new year. but. I like, I put my biggest projects and things that I was looking forward to, things I can't forget um, on here. Uh, and then I did a demonstration on they, they, them pronouns and I was so excited for that class. And then the week of Halloween, we have all the Halloween washies, Spider-Man everywhere because I'm Spider-Man. I continued with my journaling. Um, this says hold a pig, which is what we call our guinea pigs. We call them pigs. And I guess I went home this week. And then I did, um, I don't know. This one might be a plan with me. I don't know. You'll have to check the playlist. But this one, I was having a really bad day and I called my friend on FaceTime and she was actually like, it, she was interested in my planner and like how I make it pretty or something like that. So she told me you have to do one with teal. So I made a teal spread uh, on the this week and I kept doing my journaling. I use these pretty um, cat stickers with the blue and butterflies and stuff like that. And this one looks really cool. It's a little bit emptier than some of the spreads that I do aside from the journaling it's a little empty but yeah and I also figured out that these type of trackers don't really work for me and then the next week I do believe there's a plan with me for this one but I'm, I'm really not sure at this point because I don't film every week now because I have other ideas that I want to put out but this one was basically like a week where it snowed a ton and we didn't have class on one day and we had oh he said yes this is because I was planning to give a presentation on like budget and stuff for having a pet cat to my dad and I thought that I would do it on Thanksgiving but I actually ended up doing it on this day because I it just arose that he was open to talking about it so I showed him that and he said yes we can keep the cat at his house when I'm not at school and then this week was like super excited I was going to give the presentation on Thursday, which was Thanksgiving, because my family would be over and they could help me pressure him into letting me keep it at his house, but that didn't need to happen. I didn't need to wear fancy clothes for the presentation because we already did it. And yeah, I like how this turned out. I used stickers from my cousin's shop, but yeah, I like the watercolor. And I put a bunch of cats on it because the week was about the cat presentation, basically. Um, I was just trying to make it through all of my really important things and then I would make it to the cat presentation. <laughs> Next we have this really green week. I love green so much. Um, this was my other appointment to get the cat. Um, film the December bullet journal video, which I did do that. And uh, this was basically I think this was like things that I should work on up here, things that are due in this row, and then just assorted other things here. Sunday says die doing your proposal paper, and that's basically what I did, but I'm, I don't know how I predicted that or if I put it in afterward, but <laughs> that did happen pretty much. And then 
Next, I just did some really bare bones. When are my very important things due? Uh, when are people having birthdays and such? And then when my boyfriend is on leave, which he just left, which is sad, but you know. I didn't have any washi to mark it, so I just marked it with hearts. And then I did a week of pink. I think I wanted to put something in this column, but it just was too busy where I didn't add to it after I initially decorated it. So I had all of these things to do for my finals. I need a nap with some lettering, putting little kittens everywhere. Um, and this is the day I was like dancing around the apartment because I was so excited that the adoption or the like rescue that has that had Lewis said that I could adopt her. And that was like the best day ever. And yeah, just getting through finals. And then this was the week of finals. So we had a donut party and a pizza party. And I thought they were on the same day. So I would have, I would have free breakfast and free lunch, but this one was actually on Friday. So, but I didn't move it because I, I was like, okay, I'll see the donut and know it's on Friday. And then all these things I had to buy before I went home, when my tests are, chores that I have to do before leaving the apartment, and then a live stream that I really wanted to go and look at or see or whatever. <laughs> and then this one was last week, my final final. Um, we had an accident where Okay, let me see. I think I wrote it on here. So right here it says quash, which is basically just like a cute, like, um, belittling way to say crash because I we had an auto incident. Nobody got hurt and everyone's fine. Things are in the works to be replaced and such, but we did have a problem with the car, so we had to get it towed and then mail things and pick up the plates from the, um, whoever was fixing the car. So this week was basically just worrying about the car really. And then, but at the end we had a few parties and um, we went to lunch for my boyfriend's brother's birthday. And then we went ice skating, which was really fun. And since Lewis is a, used to be a stray, she had treatment for worms. So we had to give that to her and yeah. Okay, and then the last week in here, because I am doing, I did have the other week, but I'm moving to my Erin Condren because I'm done with this mess. <laughs> um, I did green and red, which is not original, I know, but I don't really care because I don't, I had just a few things to do. I had things to clean, things to film, and then basically just when is Noah going home, and I marked a milestone that um, Lewis was allowed out of her safe room and she explored downstairs over here and it is now Friday and she is more comfortable downstairs but she still has home base upstairs and yeah do laundry which is <laughs> in the washer right now and then this giant quote because I was like when else am I gonna have space to use a giant quote except for the holidays so yeah and this is what I'm doing right now so Thanks for watching my flip through. I think I did a lot of different things, but I also kind of did the same things. Um, this doesn't close when it has both pieces or like, I, I look how much is in there. I split it in half and I only had half in it at once. But yeah, if you liked the video, you can watch the other half if you haven't already and give it a thumbs up, give that video a thumbs up as well and you can subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment on like what your favorite spread that I showed was or any cool stickers that you saw that you liked and if you want to know where I got anything then I will answer you in the comments. Okay, thanks for watching, bye!